Want to add more visibility and enhance your vehicle's safety? Look no further than the Nightlight LED Taillight Light Strip. This affordable light strip comes equipped with five functions. Daylight running lights, brake lights, left and right turning lights, along with a bright white reverse light. The strip is 60 inches long, supporting 108 LEDs, both red and white. It comes fully enclosed in a silicon casing, making it weather resistant for most scenarios. Securing the light strip is a breeze with a double-sided tape on the back, as well as the included hardware for a more secure mounting. The harness connects to a standard 4-pin connector, but I will be wiring this up directly to the harness. Now, if you plan on connecting to a standard flat 4-pin connector, it will not come with a kit, so you'll need to purchase one separately. Once you have the connector, all you need to do is connect the two, and your work here is complete. Now, let's go ahead and continue with this installation. Uh, we're going to go ahead and splice this into the truck. That way I still have access to the connector in the event that I want to tow a trailer again. Uh, we're going to use these uh, for the connectors for the splicing. And you need an electrical tape, uh, socket set, and uh, a wire stripper as well. So back here, we're going to take this off and we're going to splice in here. Uh, and then we're going to go ahead and plug it back in and see and make sure everything works. Now what we have to do is identify which wires are what. We're going to do that by the front of this uh, diagram which tells us exactly which one of these uh, cables is the ones that we need to use. On the sheet here we also have, it tells us which uh, ground running left turn light, right turn light and reverse. So using this information we're going to go ahead and we're going to splice into this. Okay so for wiring the red wire is going to be your right hand turning light. The a white one is going to be your left turning light, black is going to be your daytime running lights, and the blue one is going to be your reverse light. And this big thick black one is the ground. So what I did is I actually filed this open a little bit because this wire is pretty thick and I don't want to go and sever it so I opened it up just a little bit so I can make it fit on here. Alrighty, so now we're just going to take these connectors and we're just going to uh, clamp them on. So the LED strip, I have taped it all the way with the electrical tape to make it nice and straight. And there are probably nicer ways of doing it, but this is just the only way that I have currently available for myself is with these uh, crimps. So that is how I install them. Now that everything is wired up, and I have taped everything off back, put the boot, uh, this uh, wire cover back on as well. You can go ahead and uh, reinstall it. So I just went ahead and I taped the entire thing just to make sure that I know this isn't the prettiest way, that I, but I didn't realize I made a mistake. I would, if next time, if you guys are going to be splicing in, do it a little bit higher so that this uh, isn't in the way. Uh, when you go to cover it so i made a mistake don't do that do just a little bit higher um anyways i went ahead uh, electrical taped everything so now it's watertight i'm not worried about uh water getting in there and uh now we're gonna go route it and uh tighten these bolts down and see how it works so the way that i'm routing it is through this corner right here and uh you're just gonna have to uh, push it and kind of use your finger to catch it and then pull it through. So that's how I'm routing it up and out. So as you can see, Everything's working, so now we're just going to go finish it off and just get it all nice and tight and uh, then we're going to see what it looks like at night. It's a dump truck. It's a blue dump truck. Oh, you like. So here we have the Nylite taillight strip in the evening after a storm has passed. As you can see, the light bar is extremely bright and adds such an awesome glow to the truck with the running lights. It gives it more of an aggressive look as well as the added safety for stopping and turning. 
It fits very well right behind the bottom lip of the tailgate, so depending on your angle, it's either a glow or this full effect, as you can see in the shot. So starting off with the left turning signal, then going to the right turning signal, followed by the hazard lights. And now we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna brake, and we're gonna turn it in reverse. And the reverse adds so much brightness to the backup camera, so it's very beneficial when you're out at night. And now for those of you who wanna know what it looks like driving up into the sunset, here you go. Man, that looks good. And now we just gotta have a drive-by just so you can see it from another angle. And then we're just gonna back it up and we're gonna call it a day. I have to say, with the addition of this light bar, the truck looks so much more appealing at night and I'm really enjoying the added light strip. Personally, I think it's a needed upgrade. Alrighty, so the moment that we've all been waiting for, let's find out who won the uh, oil catch can from the last video. Let's generate the comments and get this going and let's start the random pick. And congratulations to Norman Khan. You have been selected as the winner for the oil catch can giveaway. So I'm going to be reaching out to you and getting that out to you as soon as possible. So thank you everyone for participating in the last giveaway. And as I've stated in the community board on my channel, I will be doing a giveaway for this LED light strip. So let's go ahead and talk about that. So just like in the last video, all you need to do is subscribe to the channel, leave a comment down below in this video and hit that like button to be entered into an opportunity to get this LED light strip for your vehicle. So again, thank you all for watching and I'll see you guys on the next project.